markets open down as investors await a slew of economic reports this week, including earnings reports from big banks, consumer sentiment, and retail sales. Neiman Marcus is the latest retailer to be hit by hackers who stole customers' card information during the holiday season. A spokeswoman would not estimate the size of the breach. And Target is apologizing to customers for its data breach. Target bought ad space in some major newspapers today to publish a full-page apology letter. The retailer says it took swift action once the problem became known and details what it's doing to regain the trust of customers. Japanese spirit maker Suntory has acquired Beam, the maker of Jim Beam and Maker's Mark, for more than $13.5 billion. Ford is unveiling a new F-150 with a body made almost entirely of aluminum, which will lighten the vehicle by as much as 700 pounds. An increasing number of truck owners want a vehicle that's more nimble and fuel efficient. And the Chevy Corvette Stingray has been named the North American Car of the Year at the Detroit Auto Show. The truck of the year is the Chevrolet Silverado. That's your Money Watch. For more, log on to CBSMoneyWatch.com. At the New York Stock Exchange, I'm Wendy Gillette.